Arlington National Cemetery is home to more than 400,000 American heroes. The order and precision pay tribute to these lives of service. I do not believe that there is a more noble mission than the mission that we have here at Arlington National Cemetery. So how does a field of grass become this sacred soil? Mine's good! The first step is crucial. Positions from global navigation satellite systems. You can see here we're using 16 satellites. We are laying out grid monuments for the section. It's a eight inch monument. It's made of concrete. It's 30 inches deep and we'll pour concrete and set an iron pin in it, and on top of the pin, there'll be an aluminum disc with a cross, okay, and that's more. the actual grid corner. They're very accurately placed, and we have the exact GPS coordinates within hundredths of an inch. This marker is key. All these polygons get attributed and allows the GIS team and cartographer to map new cemetery sections. So we're gonna follow the same pattern. So these red the red dots are the section control markers. Those, those will be the, the graves, and we just make sure that the corner points align with these control markers. That's their reference point to make sure that what they're doing in the field aligns to what we have in the, in the GIS. This is a 5 by 10. We have to have a consistent place uh, of validated monumentation in the section that we'll use for everything that involves the burials. Getting this precision right takes a dedicated team. So when you lay them out. We take our tapes out and we uh, measure the grids vertically and horizontally, make sure they're 100 feet apart. And then we do the diagonals from uh, one point to the next to make sure the diagonals match with the Pythagorean theorem that we use for the distances. Distances that mark lives and legacies of the active duty veterans and family members who rest here means everything to the families. I feel dedicated to the veterans and their families, and uh, this is my calling. A calling that means getting all of this work done seamlessly in an environment where up to 30 funerals take place each weekday. That takes a lot of planning, a lot of strategic coordination. That, there's a lot of pride in, in taking, you know, just bare virgin ground and making it come out to the order that you see throughout the cemetery order that honors service and sacrifice. This is so very important because our nation's heroes have earned the right and the honor to be cared for in the manner that they have earned and that it is our duty and responsibility to provide. Marking and honoring those who have fought for our freedoms.